chair, we also need to make sure that we protect public safety now. So tonight, there remains in place a curfew. People are required to stay indoors starting at 9 p.m. And the order will be enforced from 10. And that will last until 5 a.m. tomorrow morning. It starts later than previous nights, which is a reflection not only of the peace that we've had on our streets, but the good policing that's been going on. There has just been an earthquake in the area. We are working right now to get shit. more information on that. We will bring that to you just as soon as we have it. We're going to take you back now to the next conference. All right, so that is L.A. Mayor Eric Garcetti. That the press conference still happening right now. And as you just heard, we were uh, listening in on NBC4. Earthquake did happen. We'll uh, try to find out that information for you as well. Uh, we did feel it here in the studio. But uh, in the meantime, Mayor Garcetti said during his press conference... I don't think I felt it. ...that city officials are making commitments to move racial... PD's efforts to hire a diverse force by implicit bias training and body cameras uh, and uh, engage officers in de-escalation training uh, to prevent the use of excessive force. Uh, his budget uh, has been criticized uh, by some. Uh, that budget now $1.8 billion. Uh, calls by the city council to reduce the budget by as much as $150 million, the, the LAPD's budget that is, to prevent critical services from being cut. Uh, he did say, Garcetti said, along with Murray Martinez mm -hmm. and Herb Wesson and other, uh, other people on the city council, that he has instructed and committed to uh, identify $250 million in cuts to invest in education and healing and to uh, be focused, that money to focus on our black communities, communities of color, uh, and to do that, that will involve cuts uh, to the police department's budget, but he did not mention what those cuts in the department's budget would be.